Normalcy has returned following a fire incident at the Justices' Chamber of the Supreme Court complex in Abuja. The complex, situated at the Three Arms Zone, was engulfed by the fire at about 6 p.m. on Monday. TV360 Nigeria's crew in Abuja was at the scene of the incident and files in this report. It was a day better forgotten in the Ori as staffs and non-staff of the Supreme Court Abuja arrived at the complex to the startling reality of a raging fire burning through the Justice's chamber. Those who were already present at the workplace at his camp are for safety. The bridge had materials and these empty fire instigators tell the true story of the fire incident. According to the head of Justice Library and former union leader at the Supreme Court, Bala Chamba, the management of the court is responsible for the undesirable situation. The point is, after the fire has started escalating to other chamber, that was when they arrived. As I told you, NJC Functional Fire Service, they are the first people to arrive. Even when they came, the fire they have, they have exhausted, the water they have, they have exhausted all the water. There is a particular point in case of such incidents where if their water finished, they're supposed to tap on that line to fill their tank. Could you believe that even that one is not be, it has not been maintained by the management? And there was no they open it. The water is there, but it's not functional. They're supposed to put water. They're supposed to be checking it in case of something like this. It's not even working. And money is being budgeted for all those reasons. That was why I blame our management staff for all this and that. That happened. Despite the losses incurred running into millions, no casualty was recorded. Honestly speaking, I want journalists to keep on following how much will be spent. That is the only thing I will, I will tell you. You know, in government business, if it is a private sector, maybe with one billion, I can work on it. But in government sector, you know, there are way the award contracts. You understand all those percentages and other things we must be taken into consideration. Mm. But I have to tell you nothing but the truth. A lot of money will be spent. While a preliminary investigation attributes the cause of the fire to an electric malfunction, the Supreme Court is yet to issue a statement, just as the Federal Fire Service and the Nigeria Police Force are expected to come up with detailed investigative reports. Tamlore Akinkoli, TV360 Lagos.